everyone and welcome to this tutorial on how to invest in the reversible ICO. My name is Dina and my job today is to make it as easy as possible for you to buy your Luxor tokens. Before we start, first things first, you have to install a wallet. To make it simple, the easiest way is to install the MetaMask browser wallet. We will start the video by quickly explaining you what is the reversible ICO and all the details that you need to know. And then I'll show you the step-by-step -step process having a browser wallet or any other compatible wallet. Let's start at the top right here. So you can see how many Luxo tokens were committed to, hence how, many, how much people intend to buy. You can see the amount of Ethereum that are pending, which is no different than the transactions that are being processed. And eventually you can also see below how many Luxo tokens are still available. When scrolling down, you can see that this information is actually reflected in this graph right here. And although it looks a little bit complicated, it's actually pretty simple. The duration of this reversible ICO is extended over a period of eight months. During those eight months, people are able to not only buy Luxo tokens, but they also have the opportunity to withdraw a certain percentage of their committed tokens. So basically when you want to buy Luxo tokens, you commit to a certain amount that is unlocked gradually over time. Say you want to commit, for example, to eight Luxo tokens over those eight months. This would mean that every month you have one additional token that gets unlocked. Now, if throughout those eight months you decide to reverse this transaction and basically get your Ethereum back, you will be able to claim the tokens that are yet locked. So basically the tokens that are not purchased yet. Now, this being said, the earlier you join the RICO, the higher is the amount of Ethereum that you can ask back. I hope this makes it a little bit clearer to you on how exactly this whole system works. For more information on the total supply, for example, or the distribution, you will be able to find all the information here on this page. Before showing you the exact process and in case you don't have a wallet yet, you can see all the way down when you take a look at the RICO FAQ, there is this question answered on which wallets you can use. Okay, enough talking, let's go straight to the point. So the first step here is to literally just accept the terms and conditions. The citizens of the countries that you can see right here, unfortunately, cannot participate in our project because of legal restrictions. Now, once you're done clicking, submit. And as you can see, the website recognizes if you have a browser wallet already installed. Here, in this case, you will just have to enable your account. Once the connection is made, you can now enter the amount that you would like to commit to. This will show you how many Luxo tokens you're buying and over which period of time those will be unlocked. Last but not least, you're also able to verify that the address that you see right here is the same one that is displayed in your MetaMask account. You can see that the transaction is pending. Now that's almost it. Super easy when you have a browser wallet. Now the second step is for you to verify your identity. Before we move forward, make sure that you copy the address that you use to participate in the RICO because you will be needing it in a second. When you click go to fractal ID, you can see that this window pops up telling you that you should select Ethereum for your wallet currency. And at some point you will be needing to enter the address that you use for this transaction. That's why I advise you to copy it beforehand. Once you land on the Fractal ID website, we strongly recommend you to use an email address to sign up. Why? Well, because if anything goes wrong, it's really hard for us to trace any transaction back using a phone number. And the second reason is that for every RICO participant, we have a surprise that you will be able to receive only via email. After entering your email, you will see that there is a clear step-by-step -step approach that Fractal ID will guide you through. Once this is all done, your transaction will finally be able to be processed. 
Now this identification process can take up to three days, but once it's finalized, you will be able to check the status of your transaction as well as your balance. If you have MetaMask, you will be able to see that you can connect directly with your browser wallet. And when you click check balance, you can see all the details of your transaction. On the right hand side, you have the commit history, hence all the transactions that have happened under the address that you're currently checking. On the left hand side, you have your total balance over here. The movable Luxo tokens correspond to the tokens that are already unlocked. Those tokens are the locked tokens, so the ones that you can return for this specific amount of Ethereum. As you can see below, you have two options. One, reserve more Luxo tokens, and the other one is returning Luxo tokens. In case you don't have MetaMask, you can use any of the wallets that you see displayed here on the left side. You will have to click send manually. And this will provide you with all the necessary data that you will have to input to do your transaction. So make sure you copy the RICO address that you see right here. And keep in mind the data field as well as the gas limit that we advise you to use. In our case here, we will use Trust Wallet. Simply click Send, select Ethereum, and then paste the RICO address you just copied before. Here you can enter the amount of Ethereum you would like to send in exchange of Luxo tokens. Click Continue. And then you will have to click the setting button at the top right corner. Enter 450k as a gas limit, as well as the data that you see right here, which is the commit function. Click send. And as you can see, the transaction is now pending and finally completed. Once this is done, you will be able to check your balance just as before using the check balance button on our website, or you can go to Etherscan. Simply copy paste the address that you've just used, click on the hash, and if you want more information, you can click to see more, which will show you the gas limit as well as the data field you just entered. This is it, people, you've made it. Now, I know we've been using a lot of technical terms, but don't worry, you will have all the information, all the answers to your questions in our FAQ. You will be able to see why your transaction is failing, for example, which wallet you should use, as well as the explanations for gas or gas limit. For more extensive explanation, you can always check out the articles on Medium and join our Telegram group for immediate support. You've got all the links in the description. That's it, people. You made it. Hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more.